guys welcome back to my channel today i'm here with a, another haul for you guys and i know i do far too many hauls but i have a problem as some of you may already know and i just like spending money and it's all my money so it's fine so this is going to be quite a random haul there is a lot of fashion a lot of clothing in there but there's also a few dvds cds a couple bits of makeup one or two bits of makeup um, but mainly clothing, fashion kind of stuff. So I'm gonna jump right on into it and I hope you enjoy this video. Also, this is stuff that I've collected over a long period of time. So it's not all just something that I've collected in one trip, definitely not. And there will also be another haul coming quite soon, which I'm gonna be doing probably with my friend Amy. We've been talking about doing it for a while, but it's going to be a Disney, pre-Disney haul. So keep your eyes out for that don't take your eyes out keep them in your sockets but look out for that haul so I'm gonna start off with all of the fashion stuff and I'm just gonna pick everything out at random I'm not doing anything in a specific order so first of all let's just pick these simple things socks I bought some um footlet footlet basically footlet no footless <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about um the socks that like cut out a big section there and you can't see them where you are like trainers or anything like that um i just needed some for holiday so i picked up a white pair and a black pair because mine after one use have already gone missing the ones that i already owned so i needed some i also have this white and black striped top which is from new look it was about four pound i think um just a simple plain vest top i also have a white one but i think it's in the wash which is why i don't have it but i have a white one which is just exactly the same as this just plain white um i just think these are really good to have in the summer just simple or even the winter or autumn whenever um just simple tops to wear and they're comfortable so i picked up a couple of these because i needed some basics i also have these green shorts right here i think it's just gone darker the clouds have come um, but these green shorts which are from boohoo they were six pound i believe they're just plain like flippy shorts they're called on the website just like loose flowy shorts i just like these because they're so much more comfortable than anything else and they pretty much go with everything and for six pounds you really can't complain so i just grabbed some of these and i wear my black ones all the time so it's nice to have a different color i also have this gray and white striped off the shoulder top now if you've seen my off the shoulder top lookbook you would have seen this i've had this for like over a month now um but i absolutely love it it was in the sale at new look i believe for seven pound um i think it was originally about 18 or something um but i just absolutely love it it's so so flattering i just really like the shape of it and i love off the shoulder tops as a lot of you will already know but i'll link the video that I did about like the off the shoulder top lookbook below so if you want to see how like I style this and all my other ones you can check that out I also bought a couple of bikinis so if you saw my ASOS haul over a month ago now I did pick up a few bikinis I sent like half no just over half of what I got in terms of swimwear back um, but I actually ordered some other bikinis from ASOS because I just realised triangle bikinis for me are the best. You can adjust them so they can kind of fit around your body shape and they're just flattering for me. They seem to hold every, well, they usually hold everything in. Um, but I saw these ones in the ASOS sale, so I picked them out and I got them sent to me, obviously. That's how online shopping works. Um, the first one is this one right here. It's just like multicoloured. Um, blue, pink, black, yeah, that colours. There's colours in it. Um, it's very crazy, different patterns like animal print, there's like tiger print, I guess it's like cheetah print, leopard print, all the prints. Um, it's just triangle, so you can adjust it, like I said before. Um, and this is from the brand Lepul, Lepul, I don't know how to say that. Um, but this was £12 instead of 20 and it also came with the shorts, you didn't have to buy them separately, which I prefer matching sets personally. I don't really like mixing and matching um, different bikini sets, but it came with the exact matching bottoms. So yeah, I just really like them. I just think they're flattering and I really, really like that. But the bikini set that I was really, really happy to get my hands on is this one, if I can get it. 
this one right here and it's just like an orange it has like yellow lining obviously um again it's quite a crazy print but orange kind of tribally print is it i don't really know um but i'm just obsessed with this print those they're really far apart at the moment <laughs> But I just think it's an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous print. Look really, really lovely with a tan, I think. Um, so I'm really excited to wear this. If I do get a tan, which I probably won't. But I'm still really excited to wear it anyway. Um, again, just sits really nicely, fits really nicely, covers everything. Um, and then it came with the matching bottoms. Just look like that. Just adjustable spaghetti strap bottoms. And this, the reason that I love this so much is because of the price. <laughs> Um, it's by a brand called, I should know the brand, Seekers Australia. And it was originally £55, £55 for this. Now it's cute, but I wouldn't pay £55 for a bikini personally, um, especially because I like buying other stuff. Um, but it was down to £15. So I'm so, 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 so happy that I got this. And as soon as I got this, it went out of stock on my size. So I'm actually really, really happy to have it. Now I also have a dress that I'm actually not sure if I'm going to be sending back. Um, I ordered three dresses from ASOS, knew that I would be sending at least two of them back because I only needed one. Um, I'm going to like a 1920s themed party and I couldn't find like a flapper dress or like a fringe dress or anything that I liked. But I found some kind of similar styles on ASOS so I picked them out. The other two, one of them was way too itchy and one of them looked like a night dress. Um, but I really, really like how this one looks on me. So this is just a maroon kind of shift dress. I don't know if you would call it a shift dress. I have no clue. Um, but it's just a very, very strappy kind of, I guess like a cami kind of style dress. It hangs down um, and it's very heavily beaded. Um, and kind of the bottom of it is what reminds me of like flapper kind of 1920s style which I think really really helps with it um the reason I might send it back it fits perfectly it looks really really good but where is it but right here you can probably see there are beads missing from the lining this is by the brand glamorous by the way at ASOS it does look really well made but then that just makes you question everything um so I don't know if beads are going to fall off. I don't know if someone was sent this dress before and they maybe yanked some of the beads off. I have no clue. Um, like you can't really tell when you wear it. Um, it just kind of, well you can see it. But unless you knew about it, I don't think you'd be able to tell. Um, so I'm not really sure. I then also have this top here. Um, it just looks like a big piece of cloth. Um, it's just like a rusted orangey brownie kind of colour. It's very, very long. It has slits at the side, like really, really high slits on both sides. But I really like this top. It's from New Look. It was, I believe, £8. It was actually a really, really good price. And they also had it in grey as well, which is really nice. But I liked this because I didn't have anything this specific orangey brownie colour. Um, so, yeah, I grabbed this. I've actually been wearing this a lot, considering it's... A very very autumnal piece I've really really been loving it and I can just see myself getting so much use out of this throughout the year so I'm really really happy to have picked this up and I like that it's just simple I like simple things at the moment so I've also got one thing that I bought from H&M and it is this grey patterned jacket and I don't know how to show it so it's like a collarless jacket it just has kind of like these different I guess tiles or sections of different grey and black and white prints. It kind of makes me feel like a mixture of like I'm going to the Queen's Garden party because it's kind of like the jackets they wear but a bit more like edgy, a bit more spiced up and like Blake Lively and anything that makes me feel like Blake Lively I want it <laughs> um, just because I'm obsessed with her style but I just think it's gorgeous. This is £30 from H&M which I don't think for a jacket like a long jacket that's going to keep me relatively warm is a bad price and I've worn it a few times since when it's been a bit cooler. Okay I only have two more fashion pieces and then I'm going to go on to the other stuff that I have. Um, I've actually realised how massive this haul is and I'm so so sorry um, but the next thing is a pair of earrings and they look like this. They're just like gold kind of leafy layered 
earrings with like a maroon stone in the middle um they're just very dangly and i just i think they look cute and you can't really tell what they're gonna look like in my ears um but i just think these are absolutely gorgeous and these are from next seven pound got a cough as some of you may have noticed if you watch my videos i don't actually wear earrings that much today is actually an exception um but i just i really really like these i'm very very fussy when it comes to earrings so if i find a pair that i really love I want them and I really really love these so I'm really happy with them. I then have a pair of sunglasses that I got from ASOS and believe it or not these were only £3.50 in the sale which to me is a steal. They look like this and I'm just obsessed with them. I've never had sunglasses with a white rim and then like the bottom is kind of like an animal print. They just look like this on I just think they're so so cute they're nothing like anything that I have I think they suit my face I'm not sure maybe they don't um <laughs> but I really really like them and I'm just like a sunglass junkie and for £3.50 I really really couldn't pass up on them so I love these okay when I said I have loads of other miscellaneous stuff I have one makeup product and DVDs and CDs so not a ton but I'm gonna go right through them now so the makeup product that I bought I actually bought this today um it's the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray and I have been wanting this for so 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 long. Um, it comes in a nice box and then it just looks like this and this just helps to keep your makeup in place all day, make it look fresh and like you've just applied it um, and also it's supposed to help in the heat which obviously I'm going to Florida and I don't plan on wearing makeup all the time or at least a lot of makeup like as much as I do um maybe just like concealer and mascara I don't know um but this should hopefully help to keep it in place if I do so for CDs and DVDs I went to HMV earlier today and they had some good movies and some good CDs in the deals um the CDs that I got are just gonna be with purpose and um I was gonna say little mix they're not little mix um Fifth Harmony 727 just because i've been raving about these so much recently like listening to them on spotify and everything but i kind of just want to have them in my itunes playlist they're cheaper than buying them on itunes at the moment together it was 2 4 15 um and i just like i want to listen to them on the plane <laughs> um <laughs> that's pretty much the only reason um no like we can put them on in the car and everything like that um but I've just been raving about them, I've been loving them, so I just decided to get them, why not? And then for movies, they always have the two for £10 deal going on, but I don't know if they always have this, but they had five for £20 on. Um, I got three DVDs, my mum got two others, so we each spent £4 on each DVD, which is perfectly fine. Um, but the ones that I got are Like Crazy, We Are Your Friends, and Magic Mike XXL and i have not seen we are your friends i haven't heard incredible things about it um and the trailer didn't look like the greatest which i probably shouldn't have bought it like in retrospect but it has zac efron in and i really like zac efron and this piece of hair is really annoying me um yeah i just I, I i love this guy i watched this once on tv and i absolutely loved it and i never see it anywhere and i saw it and i was like yes I want it it's really really good check it out if you haven't yet and magic my xxl i think this is better than the original and it's just hilarious it's so good and i wanted to get it so yeah <laughs> so that was my haul i really really hope you enjoyed if you did do give it a big thumbs up and subscribe as well also let me know what you've been buying recently and if you liked anything that i bought or if you hated it which if you did i'm really sorry um <laughs> but um definitely keep up to date with new videos on this channel i'm hoping to do like more challenges soon i really feel like my channel is lacking on funny like challenge videos and i just want to have challenges because they're some of my favorite videos to watch so i might drag a friend or two to do some challenges but there will be a lot of like holiday related videos soon and there will be a lot of vlogs after mid-september it's gone really bright now so i hope you guys all have an absolutely amazing day and i'll see you on my next video bye